y'all welcome back to another video it is vlogmas day four and um i probably should have vlogged yesterday like actual video log of my day uh but i couldn't because i had to be in the zone uh Alyssa and i went to buffy trivia night um we haven't been in a, quite a few years because uh it got closed for covid i think we did it during covid but it was like a video thing you know, like it connected online and you had to like buzz in to answer the question and get it right. And so it was really hard because um, you got points based on like how quickly you buzzed in versus the one we do normally. Uh, everybody shouts out the answers at the same time um, when you go over them and you get a score and uh, they just tally it up and see how you did. Uh, yeah, so luckily we were able to do it last night. Um, we went to the Clock Out Lounge in Seattle, which is like a bar. Uh, they sell like pizza and stuff. I uh, hadn't been before, but it was really nice. Uh, we took public transit to get there and like our bus dropped us off literally right outside the door, which was awesome. Um, and yeah, we had a great time. Um, Alyssa and I originally bonded as friends over Buffy. Um, she posted about Buffy, I think, on uh, like Facebook, uh, we were in the same ward, uh, in the YSA ward in Bellevue for, uh, you know, Mormon church stuff. Um, and, uh, neither of us are really <laughs> Mormon anymore, but, um, we had, uh, we bonded, you know, in church and also she posted about Buffy and then Big Brother were the two things I think. Um, and I was like, Buffy and Big Brother, we should be best friends. I posted on like her Facebook, like a dork and she was like, okay. <laughs> so since we've been best friends, um, and you know, I, I know it's a little socially awkward maybe to be like, hey, we should be friends. It's literally stepbrothers. Did we just become best friends? And we did. Um, but uh, sometimes that's the way you got to do it. You got to reach out to somebody and just be like, hey, you're cool. Do you want to be friends? That's how I've made a lot of my friends as an adult. And uh, people do find it strange, but most of the time they appreciate it because pe other people want to make connections too, you know? So be bold and get out there and just be like, hey, you want to be my friend? You seem cool. Anyway, back to Buffy trivia talk. Uh, so we went to the Clock Out Lounge. It was really great. Um, liked the place a lot. Alyssa got some pizza. I had a little bite. Uh, it was pretty good. Um, but... Um, really nice venue like I like the shape of it a lot it's like really open and uh, easy to like hear people and see what's going on um we had like one couple sit next to us who was like not participating and then they left and then another couple sat next to us who was not participating um but they were so precious they were this like older couple and they were just tickled that we were having uh our um like trivia night that they didn't know about and so they were like oh that's so cool it's so fun and so um, they were sitting there, you know, and they were like, oh, how do you think we're going to, you're going to do? And uh, Alyssa and I have won the trivia night multiple times in the past, um, like gotten first place. And so we're like, I'm pretty good. <laughs> but we also like didn't study a ton for this year and we haven't been in a while. So I was like, oh, we might be a little rusty. Um, but uh, we told them like, we've done really well in the past. So we think we'll do pretty good today. Um... And uh, there was a couple of questions we got where we were the only ones who knew the answer, uh, which is the best feeling at trivia when you, especially when we do it the way that we do it, where you like shout the answer out. So like for easy ones, everyone's like, ooh, that one's Angel, you know, or like, oh, that's season one that that happened. But uh, there was one question about like an earthquake that made the master in the first season, like not able to do his master plan. Uh, and like, what year did that earthquake happen in? And I was like, oh, we know this one because I just watched this and we just talked about it it um and we're the only people who are like 1937 <laughs> and people were like whoa and then they were like yeah that's right i think the host was like i have a boner <laughs> so i was like slay we did it um anyway we were doing pretty well and then we fell off in some of them that i was like Ugh. i think the worst score we got out of 10 was one round we only got six right which is like not awesome if you're gonna win um but we still did really well, um, and there's 20 teams there, and we had a three-way tie for second place, and we were one of those three. <laughs> Sorry, I keep changing angles, but my arm keeps getting tired. Anyway, um, so we were one of the top teams. We were one of the top four, I guess, um, in the three that tied for second. First place was just a team that... You know, they apparently have won a bunch of times who were there and we were like, oh, that's great for us. And then also um, our team's just me and Alyssa, um, whereas they have five people on their team. You're allowed to have up to five. So I was like, well, they have five brains working and we only have two. So second place uh, qualifying for points is not bad. But 
to see if we actually got second place. We had to do a like uh, head to head to head round of you know three teams, um, and you have to send one person up there to be your champion, and then they have to like raise their hand as a buzzer on the questions that they get answered or ask just the three of them. Um, and Alyssa has done this before for us because we once were tied for first, I think. Um, and we've had to do this at least once, uh, maybe more than once, I can't remember. But Alyssa has seen the show way more than I have. She's watched it way more than I have. She knows it way better than I do. Um, and so I was like, well, it's gotta be you, Queen. You gotta go. <laughs> um, so she went up. She got the first question right immediately. And so she qualified for the second round of it. So then the other two had to fight out for the second spot. And by second spot, I don't mean second place. I mean second spot in the head-to-head -head tournament to get second place <laughs> um, since Alyssa already qualified to get into the final round. So um, she was qualified. We got our second person. And then they uh, were head-to-head -head with Alyssa. And then they had to answer three questions. And whoever got the two right out of the three would win second place, uh, which seems like maybe a little dramatic for second place, but only first and second place got uh, prizes. Um, and uh, I actually, when they were presenting prizes, was like, second prizes sound kind of better, to be honest. <laughs> like, I don't want to get second place because I want to win, right? However, uh, I do like their prizes better. There was like a cool book and then like a bunch of pins and stuff. And I was like, that sounds better to me. Um, so I was happy that maybe we we're gonna get second place. Um, but anyway, Alyssa's up there. It's the final round of the tournament to see who gets second place. And uh, Alyssa missed the first question. Pretty easy one. She just wasn't fast enough to raise her hand. And then uh, she got the second two right. Uh, the last one I was so excited about because it was uh, what state Anya pretends that she's from. And I heard that and I said, oh my gosh, because Alyssa literally quizzed me on this before we left for the tournament like before we went for trivia and I was like yes she knows this and she raised her hand and she got it and I was just like hell yeah brother we did it um and uh I was so sad that the couple that was like sitting next to us and like so impressed by our knowledge and rooting for us uh like they literally patted Alyssa on the shoulder when he was leaving and he was like I'm rooting for you guys good luck and we we're like thank you thanks mom and dad <laughs> um but I was so sad they were there to see us win second place. Uh, we were so happy. Uh, let me show you our spoils real quick because we got some cool shit. Um, but, you know, honored to be there. Happy to win just even second place in general. And uh, feels good. Like I said, we, we were a little rusty. So it feels good to even just get second. Um, and next year we'll be more prepared. Okay, from right to left, ignore the ingredients back there for Friendsgiving. From right to left, we got St. Buffy Votive Candle, the protector. We got second place right there. Two, Clock Out Lounge, drinks, well, drinks only. Um, but uh, we, neither Alyssa or I really drink, <laughs> so that's fun. Um, but you know, that'll be fun for us to maybe go sometime. Um, we got, the book was kind of the main thing. It's uh, Into Every Generation, A Slayer is Born, How Buffy Staked Our Hearts, a book written about the show that looks pretty cool. Um, we got these like postcards here, one Willow, one Cordy, and one of Buffy and Angel. Um, we got Sunny D for Sunnydale, <laughs> the city it takes place in. We got this mug or uh, like beer stein kind of of uh, with Willow on it. Very cute. What they made. We got this Pez dispenser, this witch Pez, which Oz gives to Willow in the show. And then we got a bunch of pins. We got I'm a Slayer, Ask Me How. I'm going to ask Alyssa if I can have that one. Um, we got Kiss the Librarian. We got Willow and Tara. We got... Xander and his eye patch. We got Spike's drawing of Angel, and we've got I love Buffy uh, with a stake through the the Buffy heart. If there you can see, yeah. Uh, so yeah, these are our spoils. We got a bunch of cool, fun shit, and uh, there we go. That is what you get for getting second place at the Clock Out Lounge. So yeah, anyway, it was an excellent time last night. Had a lot of fun. Um, we always somehow ask questions to each other that do actually come up, which I'm always impressed by. Like our random trivia is like one of these will be important. Um, and uh, have a great time. Uh, it's hosted by a, a 
company called Raised by TV. Um, and uh, the host, Brandon, is great. Uh, highly recommend if you're in the Seattle area to check them out and check out their uh, like trivias that they host. They're super fun. We're considering doing Scream, potentially, because there's not that many Scream movies. And we can each just take half and see where we're at. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was really fun. Had a good time. Always like trivia. You know, I've got the tism. Alyssa's <laughs> obsessed with Buffy since she was a kid. So perfect for us. Um, and yeah, just like, you know, great time. Um, would love to go again or will go again next year, hopefully. And uh, just happy to get out of the house, do something fun and feel so proud of myself because we're so good at it. <laughs> Anyway, um, thanks for joining me today. I guess it's kind of short, but I just wanted to get a little vlog myself, let you know what we were up to yesterday, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!